stands for for inspiration and recognition of science and technology and we're an organization that encourages kids and youth in STEM, so science, technology, engineering and math. So the program is a super exciting sport where kids get to learn about STEM in a fun way like basketball or football. We want to make sure there's equal opportunity for kids and youth around the world. I think what I personally have gained from participating in FIRST for the past three years is a lot of leadership skills and soft skills. It teaches you about real life with deadlines and time management. It's such a great opportunity for everyone just to be able to meet new people, to learn so many new skills, to really get a hands-on application of the world. I think it's just made me a more social person. Probably one of the biggest things about FIRST is working together as a team. <laughs> uh, I'm becoming more extroverted. <laughs> I learn how to wire a robot. That's something you can't exactly learn anywhere else. Hatch is one of our Platinum Plus sponsors and they help us put on these amazing events. Um, and they also uh, help with volunteering, mentoring, uh, they provide judges for the competition. We get our, all of our money through dedicated sponsors, one of which is Hatch. Yeah, we wouldn't be able to do this without our sponsors at all. So they're really such a great, like, they help build the robot pretty much, but we put in all the hours, so. It's a mutually uh, fun experience from both sides, from both the students and the mentors. You can see it rubbing off. Uh, you can see them inspiring each other. So I think it's a great uh, combination and a great investment of, of your volunteer time. I would really recommend any Hatch person to get involved with FIRST Robotics. It's extremely rewarding. The best part about being a mentor for me uh, is seeing a, an aha moment and then they get inspired to go and actually then try and make it or design it and see that and become a part of the robot. To see these kids develop, grow and mature uh, has been phenomenal. How about you tell me a little bit about your team? Yeah, so this is our 17th year competing with FRC. Um, and as mentioned, uh, we were the first all-girls team in Canada. Um, yeah, we're really happy to be competing here with the best teams in Ontario. Going there and like seeing so many other people, and especially girls too, it really opened my eyes to like more career opportunities. And before I was like, oh, I want to be like a doctor or something in the medical field. But now I'm thinking more like biomedical engineering to add in like the physics and the math and the engineering that I've learned so much from this program. Before I joined FIRST, I didn't really think about engineering as a possible career. But now I did join FIRST. Um, I, I really want to become an engineer when I get older. At first, I thought I was only able to go into arts and uh, English. But I've now found out that I can go into math and STEM and engineering as well. I wanted to be a judge because it would give me an opportunity to get a more in-depth look at uh, each of the teams. To me, these practical engineering events are really important to develop the next generation of engineers. I think this is where we learn the basic life skills of how to be a business person, how to be an engineer, how to be a scientist, how to be innovative. First Robotics has been so rewarding for me because I've learned things like what drill bit to use, and I've also learned things like how best to communicate to people in the, in the community and with students, and how to engage with students that want to get involved with Hatch. The technology